New Year's Day, hangover, you know, in, in, in full force uh, in Burnley for Burnley vs Liverpool, which kicks off in 35 minutes. Uh, soaking wet, freezing cold, all the cliches for New Year's Day. Really grim, horrible day. Uh, went out in Preston last night, um, which was interesting. And uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, so here we are, Burnley away. No Coutinho, no uh, Salah. Bit of a mad team, um, maybe three at the back. Uh, but just excited to get in that away end. Uh, Leicester game feels like so long ago. Um, I've not been home since that game. Um, let's see how we get on today, up the Reds. <laughs> What a day, what a day. Um, back in Preston now, uh, in the hotel where we stayed last night, just sort of hanging around really until my train later, but um, pandemonium in that away end after Clavin's goal. Absolutely ridiculous, the limbs were superb. Didn't really capture it because I was you know, enjoying it too much, but um, huge, huge win, huge goal. Brilliant that it came from Radnor Clavin, a sloppy set-piece goal to win it at Burnley away in the 94th minute. It's just, it doesn't get any better than that. It's dog of a game, dreadful game. The first half was hideous. Um, honestly, one of the most mundane house football I've ever seen. It was just really dogging it out. Um, get a great goal through Mane on the hour mark. You, you start to think that's enough, but we we let it slip. Um, you know, Joe Gomez kind of falls asleep. Um, you know, whether he's culpable, I don't know, but you know, he probably could do better on that. And then, but but the winner is just a beautiful, beautiful moment. Um, one of my favourite moments of the season, if not my favourite. And, and and just the, the manner of these two wins over the last. Uh, 48 hours against Leicester and Burnley have just been absolutely what you want to see from this Liverpool side. Not we're not just good at you know beating teams four or five nil. We've proven that we can dog it out. We can face adversity, come back into it, get the wins. And the key performance today, I thought Oxley Chamberlain was very good. I thought Lallana was sensational. I think you know he slotted straight back in. It, 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 it's been frustrating having to wait so long for him to come back, but the fact that he's come back and hit the ground running, I thought it was superb today. I thought Trent Alexander Arnold was very good. Uh, Clavin and Lovren were fine. I thought they, you know, I mean, absolutely battered by Ashley Barnes for, for 90 minutes, but you know, they they battled well and uh, they did fine. Uh, Mignolet, I thought was fine. Chan, Van Alden, Van Alden in particular, I thought did very well. Uh, Chan was okay. His passing was a bit off at times. Um, not the ideal performance from him, but you know, when it mattered, he he was he was present. Um, Mane, his touch was horrendous in the first half. I thought it was going to be another one of those days for him, but. He bounced back with that wonderful goal. Uh, hopefully that does wonders for his confidence. Um, huge moment for him. Lovely strike with his left foot. And uh, yeah, hopefully he can build on that because Salah's going to be out for a couple of weeks now. So Mane's going to need to step up with Coutinho probably absent as well for the Everton game. So Mane, you know, we know he loves playing against Everton. Let's hope he can score against them on Friday. Solanke, uh, kind of a, a difficult one. Uh, I know a lot of people on Twitter have been slagging him off, saying he's not good enough. Um, it's a tricky one. He he worked hard. He was he was always busy, but for me, no real goal threat. You never really fancy him just to score, um, which is a concern for, for me. Number nine, you know, from the guy playing in number nine when Firmino came on, we looked a bit more threatening. Um, but look, to get that win, 
with so many key players absent was huge. Burnley, not an easy place to go, not an easy team to play against. Honestly, this day couldn't have gone much better. Um, the tiredness has hit me, I'm shattered, I can't wait to get to bed. Um, but uh, all worth it. The whole weekend has been completely worth it, thanks to that Ragnar Klavan goal. One, uh, one that would be a standout goal for this season. And we, were, we move on to the FA Cup on Friday against Everton. Um, very excited for that. Should be a great night at Anfield. Um, let's hope we can get some revenge after they beat us one all um, last time. We need to beat these guys this time. They've just lost to Man United today, 2-0. Um, you know, let's, let's, let's put them to the sword. Let's, let's bulldoze them. Let's go through to the fourth round in the FA Cup. Let's win a trophy this season. Uh, but honestly, the form at the moment, I think I'm beaten in 16. Superb. Very happy. Couldn't be happy. I've still got Van Dijk to come into the side as well. Anything's possible. Glorious stuff. Up the Reds. See you soon.